going guys okay so today's video will be about repairing damaged relationships sometimes relationships can be like roller coasters you know they could have their ups they could have their downs um, there are a variety of relational problems that come from what are relational transgressions which according to our textbook looking out looking in are when one partner violates the explicit or the implicit terms of relationship uh, you will now see a variety of scenes displaying examples of what are relational transgressions Oh, David West is not getting. Look at that. That's all day. Oh, that's great. Alright. Magic Johnson, aka Lonzo. That's AIDS. Literally. Dude, come on! This is Joe O'Neill. Lakers passing it around. And the basket by Johnson. I don't even have any words. You just can't guard me. So nah, guard this game is just stupid, dude. No, you just can't guard me. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Here's Hardaway. Look at that. That's that's the more realistic. That's more like it. But that's how you make a quick move. You gotta get it. You just can't guard it. Look, that's that's. Come on, Shaq. That's happening. That's happening. That's, happening. that's real. Come on, Kobe. Damn. Oof. Ah, oh, dude, Shaq's making that. Give it to Kobe, give it to Kobe, give it to Kobe. Pull up. You just can't guard it. You just can't guard it. You just can't guard it. Come on, man. Dude, just finish the game. Just finish the game, man. Okay, so what you just saw was one of the guys in the video was raging and physical violence was also involved. Both are an example of problematic emotions and aggression, which are relational transgressions. What you are about to see is the repairing part of the conflict. You can clearly see how he makes amends by expressing regret and by apologizing to his friend for raging and for pushing him down. Wait, why am I doing this? Like, Play the clip. Go. Oh, what's up? What's up, man? Sorry for flipping out earlier, bro. That's uh, not that's not usually like me. It's all good, bro. Don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. Hey man, uh, are you busy? Man, listen, I just got some problems, and uh, I was wondering if uh, you you had any chance to talk, man. Um, could really use a friend right now. No, man, um, I can't go. I'm actually just uh, doing something for my mom. Yeah, sorry. I'll just hit you up another time or something, bro. All right, then. Sounds, uh, I understand, man. Um, how about I, I'll, I'll call you another day. Maybe we can hang out sometime. Yeah, for sure. Just hit me up. But, I mean, I might be doing something for my mom next time, too. So, I mean, yeah, just hit me up, though. What you just saw is an example of distance, psychological separation to be exact, which is another example of relational transgression. His friend is in desperate need of an ear to listen, but he purposely lies to him by saying he is busy, but clearly he is not. Now you'll see the reparation of the conflict when he comes over to apologize to his friend. By apologizing, he is expressing regret and also he is accepting responsibility. Hey bro, I'm sorry, I, I just lied the other day when I said when I was with my mom, I was just really playing video games, I didn't want to go hang out, I'm sorry for lying to you. Um, yeah, I appreciate your honesty, man, um, it's all good, don't worry about it, uh, how about we grab some lunch later? Yeah, sounds good, bro, I'll see you then. Hey, what's up, hey, what's up, what's up, what's up? Um, Man, I'm not trying to do this project for Mr. Whiskey. It's me either, dude. The new Call of Duty came out, and I'm trying to play that. For real? Yeah. But I'm trying to get started on it today. For how about Saturday? All right, Saturday works. Saturday. All right, for real? Hey, but all right, just come over Saturday, and we'll we'll get this done. All right, I'll all be right. there. All right, sounds good. All right, see ya. On time. Yeah, for sure. All see right. ya. Uh, Devin, uh, where you been, man? Uh, you're supposed to be at my house like five hours ago. I've been working on this project. 
Oh my bad, Luis. I got caught up on double XP weekend. It's only this weekend, so you know I got you know I gotta grind. Bro, this this project's due next week. Uh, I'm just trying to get this finished, man. Uh, I'm just disappointed, man. You're supposed to be here five hours ago. You know this is important. Are you still there? I'll head there over right now. Nah, man. Whatever, man. I I'll, I'll just get it done myself, man. I'm I'm just disappointed. I thought we we're I thought we we're I thought you're my best friend, man. Okay, so what you just saw was how Devin made a commitment to Luis that he would go over to his house and work on the project but as you can see he failed to do so which is an example of the relational transgression failure to honor an important obligation or also a lack of commitment now what you're about to see is how he comes over and attempts to repair the damaged relationship by expressing regret making resolution and genuinely repenting Luis is about to be mad. Hopefully, he needs help with that project. Hey, Luis, I'm here to work on a project. Dude, I'm already pretty much done, man. You took forever, so I just wanted to. Oh, wanted... are you serious? Yeah, man. I'm sorry, dude. No, you're not. Hey, what, what I need to do to make it up to you? No, no, no. Hey, how about I do the outro? How about I do the outro? Do you already work on the outro? Yeah, that's finished too. Hey, Luis, real talk. I'm sorry, it won't happen again. Man, I guess so. Hey, but now that we're done, we go play some Call of Duty, right? Are you serious? Yeah, of course. Yeah, you're right. All right, let's go. All right. All right, well, that concludes our video on repairing damaged relationships. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm here with Rosendo, with Devin. And a special shout out to Dionel, Christian, for contributing, and also Chris and Elise. You know, again, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.